I woke up like this deep divers all magical and shit. Royal blue suits, I'm feeling myself deep divers. Now, shout out to everyone who is trusting the process right now. Shout out to everyone who is trusting the timing of their life. Shout out to everyone who is trusting their journey. I'm crazy. Not just a little bit crazy deep divers, but very extremely crazy. Why? Because in 2011, I let it all go. Like everything that was going on at the time, I dropped all of it. And I said, you know what? I'm gonna figure this thing out. I don't know how, but I'm gonna trust the process. I'm gonna trust my journey. Now fast forward, it's all worked out. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Because the universe works in my favor. Say it with me, deep divers. The universe works in my favor. One more time. The universe works in my favor. Raising the frequency, raising the vibration, sprinkling that good ass energy on you right now, deep divers. Take that, take that, take all of it. <laughs> Let's start this off right, deep divers. Let's go. Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. And the cat down the road loves you. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in the wonderful, magnificent nature art gallery. How you feeling today, deep divers? I'm FaceTiming you right now. If you are watching this video, this is your confirmation. You are going to be celebrating something major soon that will rock you out of your chair and you'll be like, oh my gosh, I can't believe it happened for me. I want you to know deep divers that in this moment, you can trust that everything is really gonna be okay. Why? Because we are gonna make it okay. And that's what we have to do in life. We gotta make it okay. Because it's not just going to be okay. No, you got to make it okay. <laughs> I'm crazy. I let it all go to move forward. I had to learn how to trust the process, to trust my journey, to trust the timing of my life. And now I'm reaping the benefits. But I want to share these jewels with you, deep divers. I'm not just talking out of my ass, I've actually manifested. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? <laughs> so, 2011, I left a very high paying job, beautiful job, and I'm working with children with autism. I love that, ADHD, and 300 people applied for that job. I got it. I'm crazy. Why do I want to why do I want to leave this job? Why do I want to leave this job like the staff are treating me good? But you see inside of me, inside of me, I had a greater dream and a vision. I said, you know what? I want to inspire people to become their greatest version. I want to inspire people to live their best life. Deep divers, are you hearing me? And I let it all go. People around me thought I was crazy. They're like, Ralph, what on earth? What on earth are you going to do? You got to start from scratch. In that moment, I had to learn how to trust the process. My oh my, I was looking a little bit shaky, baby like a little lamb lost in the woods. Which way to go? I have no idea, but I'm gonna figure this thing out. Fast forward, I'm here, deep divers, looking fresh to life. <laughs> How did I do it? First and foremost, in this life, you are gonna be tried and tested. You are gonna face trials and tribulations, delays, detours, and roadblocks. And therefore, we're gonna have to learn how to trust the process. You may wanna get somewhere in life, but you're not there yet. And I wanna remind you just because 
it's not happening for you right now, it doesn't mean that it won't happen. You see, I only ever sleep with one eye open, deep divers. <laughs> I only ever sleep with one eye closed. <laughs> because I don't want to fall completely asleep. We got work to do. We got to put in those 10,000 hours. We got to level up. We got to grow more, be more. So when I first started, I had a vision and I knew what I wanted, which was to inspire millions of people. That has already manifested. So to let go and trust the process to move forward in your life, you have to know what you want. You have to know where you want to be. You have to be the co-creator of your own life. If you aren't creating your life, someone else will. If you aren't living your life, someone else will live it for you. And you don't want that. Patience, that word, is needed to let go and trust the process. Trust the timing. I had to learn patience. I'm like, I just want it right now. Universe said, sit down, Ralph, you got to wait. And I had to learn how to be patient, to realize there are seasons and cycles, but it's going to happen for me. And it did happen for me. And it's still happening for me, deep divers. Because I said, no one is going against me. I am in my own way. The whole universe is conspiring to help me achieve what I want. All I have to do is not give up on myself. So I believed in myself. I had to love what I was doing back in the day with a beautiful afro. Peace, infinite waters. I loved what I was doing and I wasn't focusing about, I wasn't focusing on how much money I could make, how famous I could be. I was focusing on whether or not my heart is in this and my oh my, my heart was in this. I loved it. And I realized that Still, I'm not making any progress, but that's okay. So long as I have passion, so long as I have a good attitude towards what I'm doing, one day I'm going to reach the top, the top of the mountain. We're here right now. When we talk of letting go and trusting the process, I had a lot of distractions around me. I had a lot of people whispering in my ear saying, Ralph, it's not going to work out. But I had to have the courage to believe in myself. And that's where the line came, the universe reveals its secrets to those who dare to follow their hearts. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. I have the power like he man, and I dare to follow my heart. To some people I looked crazy. To me I said, I know what I'm doing. Because one day, down the road, I'm going to be at that place I've always wanted to be at. We are here. One brick at a time. That's what I did. Day in, day out. People say, Ralph, you're the Michael Jordan of YouTube. You're so consistent. Gosh, how? It's because I love what I'm doing. And I realize one brick at a time builds the house. A lot of people start laying the bricks down, then they go off to try and build another house, then another house. Me, I just stayed in one space, one spot and said, let me build here. Let me grow something here because one day my time is gonna come. One day it's gonna happen for me, like it's gonna happen for you deep divers. But I had to trust the process. And when we talk of trusting the process, trusting the timing of your life, it doesn't mean just to be passive and wait. A lot of people just say, trust the process. Like that means anything. No, you also got to act. You got to be about it, not just talk about it. You got to get your little fingers dirty, be in the trenches, late nights. You really want to give up right now, pull out your hair. Don't do that because it's pretty beautiful. There were days when I really wanted to quit. I'm like, gosh, this is too hard. 
The cat down the road told me, if it was easy, Ralph, everybody would be doing it. Just because it's your dream doesn't mean it's gonna be easy. In fact, it's gonna be hard in the beginning, but it gets easier. You see, the journey does not get easier. You just become stronger. What? And now we're here, deep divers. I'm crazy. I let it all go and trusted the process to move forward. You see, what happened to me, deep divers, was that I realized that I know what's best for me. I know what makes me happy. And you have to know what makes you happy. You have to drown out the voices of the crowd. Their opinions don't matter. This is your life. You have to stare at yourself in the mirror. Live your life according to your own terms and conditions. But realize no one is going to give you a handout. You're on your own in the beginning. And that's why you have to have a great relationship with yourself. You got to love yourself, hug yourself, accept yourself, kiss yourself, dance with yourself. Don't give up on yourself. The moment you want to throw in the towel, that's the exact moment the miracle happens. So I had to learn that one day it's going to happen for me. But in the meantime, let me act. Let me love myself. Let me have a clear vision of what I want. Let me surround myself with people who remind me who I am. Your network determines your net worth. I like that. Who you hang around is who you're going to be. Energy is contagious. I had to distance myself from people who were shabby, who weren't serving me to make space for people that were. How many of you are surrounding yourself with someone who's taking you to the next level today? If you're watching this video, congratulations, because you're doing that. I let it all go. But I had a dream. I trusted the process. I trusted the timing of my life because I realized my timing is my timing. I can go at my own pace. And it all worked out for me. A lot of people are competing, comparing themselves with other people. They're in a different race altogether. You're only going to be left behind. So I said, okay, I'm running my own race. I only want to be better than who I was yesterday. There's nobody like me, deep divers. Am I lying? And that's the reason why I'm winning in life. Mm. Because my uniqueness is my power. Mm. So many people in this social media world are comparing their ass to other people's their muscles to other people's, their bank accounts to other people's, their cars to other people's, and you are being distracted from where you really need to be. Comparison is the greatest thief of joy. To let go and trust the process so you can move forward, you must focus on yourself. Not the doom and gloom of the media. You must do more of what makes you happy and have this attitude of gratitude that will shift you into a whole that will shift you into a whole new frequency just saying thank you even if things aren't working out just say thank you because the more you say that the more they will work out there's a law of consistency and there's a law of act like you've already got the part that's what i did you know when i was in university, I would wear suits every day. People would, people would be like, gosh, businessman. I had to reprogram my mind to start feeling worthy by how I would dress, how I would talk, how I would walk, carry myself with a different energy, act like it's already here. So you can move yourself into that same frequency and vibration. This is how to let go and trust the process. Act like it's already here by acting like you already have the role in your own movie. Be the author of your own story. 
take back creative control of your own life. Deep divers. I let it all go. People thought I was crazy. I thought I was crazy. Then I realized I was actually, I realized I was actually smart. The reason why is because I took a calculated risk and this is how to trust the process. Trust your journey. I play big. I put all my chips on the table and said, you know what? It's gonna work out. Why? Because I put all of my chips on the table. It has to work out. I'm gonna find a way it has to work out. I can't go home empty handed. I didn't come this far just to go home empty handed. This is how to let go and trust your journey, trust your process. You have to take that risk. You have to face your fear in your greatest fear holds the key to your greatest evolution. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. Do more of what you are afraid of. Do more of what you are afraid of. One more time. Do more of what you are afraid of because that's how you grow. Discomfort is how you grow. Your comfort zone is how you stay the same. Every day challenge yourself because that's how you go to the next level. Seven day vegan challenge, take care of your health. Health is wealth. Have a loving relationship in your life and remind yourself it's okay not to be there yet. Take off the pressure sometimes. Yes, pressure creates diamonds, but don't burn yourself out. Realize that you're doing great. You're doing better than you think. And it's okay to be the work in progress and the masterpiece at the same time. You're not finished. Your story is not finished. And one day you are going to be at that place you've always wanted to be. And then just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? there. Learn from people who are already there, mentors and teachers. That's what I did. That's why I'm here. Gratitude. Deep divers. <sighs> Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Go and get the new book, Deep Divers, for more powerful, life-changing information just like this. Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book. Also, Go and get the Good Ass Prana shirts at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. If you're a sexy ass model, whoa, who's trusting the process? You've got a whole lot of heart. You want to model the clothing? Well, go and buy some. In this moment, deep divers, you can trust that everything is really going to be okay. Why? Because we are going to make it okay. When life gives you lemons, you Better make some lemonade for, for us all, Deep Divers, okay? That's a lot of lemonade. <laughs> Hit that like button, Deep Divers. Share this video. I love all of you. Remind yourself, your attitude is everything. The attitude you have towards failure, the attitude you have towards yourself, it must always be one of harmony. I love all of you. Peace. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace. Yo, once again, hit that like button. Share this video, leave a comment down below of love and appreciation. And let me know how this video resonated with you, deep divers. You want me to go live? Just say, go live, Ralph, button. Go live, Ralph. One love, peace.